Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a Zaffle swimsuit haul. If you don't know what Zaffle is, it's this very affordable um, website. I was going to call it a swimsuit website, clothing website, but it's not just that. They have shoes, they have uh, accessories, they have bathing suits, clothes, guys and girls. Um, they just have a bunch of stuff on there. And it's just like a really cool uh, website. So um, I have ordered from them once before which was another four bathing suits they're good quality for the price like they're only like fifteen dollars maybe like if you go onto the clearance uh section they're like nine dollars or something i did find two that i ordered that i didn't like um they probably work better for someone with a bigger chest also i ordered every single one in a small um and some of them are still a little big so i would say if you want any of the ones that i got um, you should probably order a size down. I can't go smaller than a small. They don't have extra small. But, um, I'll tell you the ones that are bigger and which ones are not. Um, once I ordered the first time, more smalls, and they're a little tight. So, I guess it just depends, but I'll let you know. And I'll link all of them down below. And I'll be showing pictures on what they look like on the website and what they look like on me. Um, so yeah, if you want to see what I got, then just keep watching. Okay, so the first one that I got is this it looks weird like this it's this red underwire kind of bikini um I don't know what it's called I'll show you the picture it does have padding in it that you can take out if you'd like the clip in the back is not very sturdy like like when you clip it together it does feel like it could probably just unclip at any point like there's like um double line is that what it's called i have no idea but um so yeah that's the top it does have adjustable straps as well so that's really good i can't tell which way the like which is the front which is the back which is not good but um that's how most of the bathing suits are so if you don't like that you probably wouldn't like them they do have a few with uh bigger more coverage bottoms but um there's also not a tag on the back like so you can see which side is the front and the back on most of them. This one does happen to have one, but I don't think it does that on any of the other ones. But, um, the back just has the tag, and on the inside it has the white lining for the front, which is a little weird because it's obviously too long on this side. It's just kind of bunchy right here, and you can see that from the outside, I think. Maybe that's just mine. I don't know, but these are what the bottoms look like. Yeah, so that's that one. I really like that one. I think that looks so pretty on tan skin. I'm gonna say that about half of these, but um, I wanted a red and orange bikini because I think those look really good on tan skin. I saw Tana Mojo wear one of these and a bunch of other people who have these, and I was like, I'm just gonna buy this for fun, and it did work, and I love it. So that's really good. The next one is this. It's called like an abstract bandeau bikini or something, but to me it kind of looks like the ocean. And this is the top, it's a bandeau bikini, obviously. There is padding, um, yeah, there is padding in this one, um, and there's a way to take it out. On the top, like up here, or the bottom, can't remember which one, I think it's this side right now. It's a little looser than the bottom, yeah, you can see it, how it's bigger up here. Disappointing, but it's still really pretty. Um, so these are the bottoms. Let's see, like the tag is on the side. I don't know which one's the front or the back. Where's where we at? So these are the bottoms for this one. Um, this is the smaller side of the back or the front, and you could wear it either way, really. But if you wear the bigger side on the front, it comes kind of around the crease of your crotch, and I don't really like that. But then, like if you wear it on the small side, it comes up really far on your crotch, and it just it looks weird either way. To me. I just don't. Maybe that's... I don't know. I don't really know. It looks fine either way. And this is also double lined. I wish you could feel this. It's so soft. And it just... It feels like really good quality for what you're paying for. Like, this next one I got is this, um... I don't even know what kind of color this is. Pink. It looks a lot more pink on camera than it does right here. But it's like a paler pink and peachy maybe kind of color. I don't know. Bad at describing things. And it does have regular straps. So this is the top. This thing does come un like off of it. You can just take it off if you want to. Um, there's a cut in both of the sides and right in between your boobs. <laughs> right there. And this one is a little loose on the straps. I ordered a small. I don't know what else to do. Um, 
But this is the top and I got this one because I also thought this would look very pretty on someone who was really tan. So these are the bottoms. Once again, can't tell which one's the front or the back. But um, it, this one, no, yeah, this one a little more than the other ones is bigger on one side. So it does look different if you wear that side on the front or the back. It's up to you really. Um, yeah. The next one I got is this really pretty pink, um, I don't know, beachy looking bandeau top. It has a ukulele, a pineapple, flamingo, palm leaves. And on the side on this one, it's like, it has like a wire in it. It has padding on the front. No, it has padding on the back. The back is not double lined, but the front is. These are the bottoms. This would be so cute, like for like a picture, like by the blue ocean, not the Myrtle Beach ocean. Next is um, the orange one I got that didn't work for me. Um, it looks cute. And I thought since it was like another bandeau kind of thing, I could make it work and it like ties up the front. But no, it doesn't. Um, I think it's just because of either the texture or how long it is like this. Cause when I put it on, it like bunches a little bit right here. It does have padding. You can take it out like on a, all the other ones. It ties up the front. These feel so good when you put them on. I don't know how to explain. Like, they just feel good. I like I like these better than I like any other bathing suits I've gotten from Victoria's Secret, anything. So the second one I got that I didn't like um, is a white one. I got this one, one because white looks good if you're tan, and um, these had full coverage bottoms in case I wanted to wear this around, you know, anybody but myself. This is the back, and this is the front. Um, I don't really know why I got these, because I already have a white pair of bottoms. I don't know. But I got these. And um, it looks kind of like a diaper, so that's good, but so do my other ones, so I don't really know what to do about that. And on the top, can you hear that? I don't know when he's going to stop doing that. The top is supposed to be like a halter top, like with these things, and they're very awkwardly placed. Like why are they almost in my armpits? Like that's weird, but you can take them off, so that's good. But the top is the same thing, it was a little long on the side so it bunched up like right here. And this one does have padding in it, as you can probably see. This one just didn't work for me, I didn't like it. I did like the bottoms on the orange one though, I would like to keep the bottoms. but. What are you gonna do about it? So next, these are the ones that um, I got the first time. I just thought I'd mention them, just because I wanted to. Um, I can't even make this look normal right now, but I'll show you it on me. It's very complicated, but it's very cute for pictures, not for tanning, not for anything else, but like just walking around. If that's what you like to do in a bathing suit. It's a little loose on me up here. This is the only one piece. It's definitely not a one piece, but you know what I mean. Um, bathing suit I own. I don't like one pieces, but I think the ones that have like the cool designs and like come like right down the middle are very cute. So I got this one just to try, just like the red one, but the red one I like. So I have not worn this one yet or taken a picture of it because it's very complicated to get on. This little strap right here is attached only at the back and comes around the front of your stomach like that. That's that one. The next one I got is this really cute, like, I'm gonna put a picture of what this reminds me of, like, up here. It's a song cover. Not like a cover. It's like the album cover of a band. And, um, that's what it reminds me of. So it, like, goes around your neck and you put your arms through here. And this goes around your back and you just take the really long strings and wrap them around the front of you and tie them around the back. This one does have padding in it as well. And then for the bottoms, these are also very full covered. There are slits on the, like, not really on the sides. These are double lined on the front, not on the back, but who cares? Um, yeah, so I don't wear the bottoms with these. I wear black bottoms that I already have with this, but you really could wear any, any bottoms with this that you want to. So yeah, that's that one. And the next one is my second favorite, I think. This one is the one that I was saying is the bandeau top that's very small and is really tight. 
who's that fitting? There is no padding in this. Um, I don't really mind that because it doesn't really show at all. It is double lined, so that's good. Um, and then it ties up the back like a corset kind of thing. You can turn this around to the front and leave it a little bit untied like that and then tied at the bottom. Whatever you want. This looks a lot more neon on camera than it is. Like, that's what it really looks like. I don't know if you can see that, but these are the bottoms that are also double lined, front, back, who knows. These, these are like smaller on the hip part than the rest of them. These just feel so good and soft and good quality. So I saved the best for last. This is my favorite bathing suit of all time out of everyone I've ever gotten. So it does have like straps instead of a bandeau. It cuts kind of low and the straps are braided, which is cool, but on the back it's like a little lace-up corset moment. And the strings are really long for no reason at all. Most of their strings on their bathing suits are crazy long. Like these, you can't really tell, but they're really long for no reason. There's padding in it. I love this. I love it. It makes you look so good. Um, and the bottoms, they have like a different version of this. Different colors and tie-dye. I love everything I've gotten from them, except for the two that didn't fit. This whole order was like $70, but they were having a sale like code that they had up at the top and it gave me like a certain amount off, but then I um, was looking for a better code to get more off and I found one. I don't remember what it was. I'm sorry, but um, you can probably just look up Zaful coupon code. He's doing that thing again. I got all these for like $56. I ordered all these for Beach Week, even though I already I have like, I have 11. I'm only going to be there for seven days. That's not even the point, it doesn't matter. Um, I'm probably gonna order more, so what are you gonna do? I just really think everyone should try this if they want a affordable um, bathing suit brand, if they want some clothes, jewelry, sunglasses, shoes. If you want to check out any of these bathing suits, I will have them linked below. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.